pretty nifty in theory. Then why am I here? They offered me cash. I took it. You have to go back another feet. Fort Fallon is basically the coolest, the kookiest, the kunky junkiest cat in town. Ford Fairlane. Andrew, automatically, there's so much controversy around Andrew. I thought, gee, I'd like to see what this guy's all about. What is it they call you? Mr. Rock and Roll Detective? Please, save it. It's too early. And then I was looking forward to meeting him because, you know, of all the controversy around him. And he turned out to be a very pleasant surprise. I mean, he's a teddy bear. He really is. Mr. Fairlane, I'm very rich. The kind of rich that warps minds. Nothing offends me. When I was 11, I walked in on my father, the Shetland pony he gave me for my 10th birthday. Does that excite you? I don't know. I never met your father. <laughs> that wasn't in the script, in the original script. That was Andrew's input. Uh, yeah, he was full of surprises in that sense. Arnie. Uh, uh. Mr. Crunch has a lot of fans who hate his guts. Oh, honey, sometimes when we touch the honesty's too much. Watch out, get out of the way. We are ready here to shoot another fantastic scene. Can you see the excitement on his face? <laughs> He's ready to go. Quiet, Bob. I love the detective genre. I'm a big sucker for all of that kind of hard-boiled stuff. <laughs> Dice and I just sort of had a no flinch, natural sense of timing. I never worried the dice was gonna hit me, and he never worried that I was gonna hit him. <laughs> That's all me going down with the boat. In fact, when the fist punches through, I'm really below deck going down with the boat when they were doing that, and we could even get the guys to come in and give me air and stuff. Nobody wanted to get down there because of what was floating in the water. More important, I got a school of guppies caught in my underwear right now. Nobody believes me. Some of it's kind of scary. I mean, you know, the guys that really did the big stunts, I mean, you know, they used... I don't see how you could ever get used to jumping off buildings. The building is a symbol of the music industry, a business where anything can happen. Usually does. Just standing on the top of the Capitol buildings right near the edge, I mean, you get that feeling in a part of your body like somebody kicked you, you know what I'm saying? I mean, it, you know, I, I wasn't crazy about it. I did it because I'm a team player. Would you look at that. Zuzu, in terms of the storyline, is the clueless clue. Priscilla Presley's character tells Andrew Dice Clay's character that I'm her sister. I need you to find my little sister. Another character says I'm their daughter. She's my daughter. Chief of police thinks I'm a psychopathic killer. Some psycho groupie killer. Some people are trying to kill me. <laughs> Some people are trying to save me. That's all right, if you fall, I'll make it. <laughs> so I have something but I won't tell now. Just start torturing me, man. Torture you? I'm not gonna torture you, Ford. I've always tried and wanted to play the heavy role. Uh, and uh, years ago, my baby face just wouldn't let me do that. If I had my druthers and the roles were comparable between a good guy and a bad guy, I'd probably take the bad guy. <laughs> Dump the body in, shall we say, Chinatown. Wayne is the nicest man. Wayne Newton is just 
He sent me flowers for my birthday. I don't think he forgets an incident. You know, Wayne Newton, great guy. He is so, so considerate. And again, great to work with. I'm a new Wayne Newton fan. <laughs> The adventures of Fort Fairlane. I don't know, it's just, it's an adventure in itself, I think. Uh, uh, Andrew's an adventure. Uh, keeping up what he does as, an, as a detective is an adventure. <laughs> you never really know what's going to happen. And what's next after Dice? Hey, I'm going to Disneyland. Tone low saying, I'm out of here. Peace. Now that's rock and roll, eh?